Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Outlast, episode five. Wow, I've done quite a few now. I'm currently in my dressing gown. I'm feeling a bit ill today, unfortunately. <clears throat> oh, sad times, but I want to make an episode anyway, so I can keep up. I'm going to try and get an episode a day from here on out. So, without further ado, let's continue on through the sewers to battle Walker, I believe. So we're right back where we were last time. So we decided that we were going to go for the boop female no not the female. The prison block drain first. So let's do that. So Walker comes in any second now, so let's get behind here. And peek at him. Hmm. I'm worried you can see me through this little hole in the boxes. It's not very nice. Go. Put the camera away. The last time we moved them. Is he gonna see me here? Oh shit, no! What a terrible start! Run! Jump! Yeah! Oh shit, I can't see a fucking thing. Into the locker I did last time. What's the buttons again? That one. Yeah. Whew. Oh god. I've had a break from this for about a, a week. Oh, it's amazing how quickly you can get straight back into the poop and scariness. Hmm. seem to be coming. Let's have a look around while he's not here. If that door starts to shake, we run. Guess okay, gently open this door. So in the last episode I must made the mistake of running straight out here. And he was waiting for me. He's there. He's walking away. And he stopped. And he's walking away. Sounds like you might be getting further away. Or he's just pacing back and forth in this area so I can't get out. Excellent. Let's get in the locker. I'm leaving the door open because I don't want him to smash it down. It's like an extra layer of defense. What? Is he cheating? Is there any other way I can go? Okay, he's coming in now. <sighs> Let's go for it. <laughs> Dukes! Let's take this opportunity to go straight to number two. There's a hole there I can crawl under. So that'll be my way back. Something to slide through here. 
Safety, safety, I feel safe now. So this should be, in theory, valve number two. Excellent. Oh, and it's saving, it's saving. That's the checkpoint. Whew. Defeated by Sweet Dukes. Uh, I'm quite proud of that play, to be honest. I've got a mess. Oh, okay, he's already back. So my thought here was I might be able to outrun him. Run, 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 run. Jump. Run. Okay, so this should be... Yes. Go down the ladder. Go down the ladder. Oh, my lord. I can't look down. I can't see where I'm going. This isn't good. I really shouldn't be playing this when I'm ill. The combination of tense nerves and the fact I feel a bit sickly today. Sending my belly into some kind of horrid overdrive. Okay, this place is full of dead people. Can't be fooling me, can he? Nearly jumped. He nearly got me steam. Ah, ladder's back up. To where Walker is, hopefully not. That's it. Hopefully we'll get back to... Okay, me no likey. So that's where we just were. Oh. Admin block. Okay, so we're going to the admin block now. Another checkpoint. Whew. So something just killed that dude. I can hear drip. Uh, if Walker comes at us now, all we can do is run back to the uh, ladder. Is that a guy with a torch? Oh, batteries. Two. Double whammy. Now I can charge up the taser that I don't have. <sighs> Just my torch. Flash. Not flashlight or a torch. My night vision on my camera. Oh. Barricaded him in there very self in there very poorly. Any more information? No. Oop, that's too bright. This is a box. Let's proceed through the sewer a little more. Oh, let's get them more crazy. Oh, it seems to be a nice slow bit and calm before the storm, I would imagine. But we'll see. We'll see. Male ward, female ward. Do I have a choice? Let's go this way first. Okay. 
Let's go this way first. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's blocked. Whew. So there's only one way to go. We're going back to the male ward now. I don't know why. We're trying to escape, I believe. But why we went we through the sewers via the showers. Yummy, yummy, yummy. And a box. With more guts on it. Oh god. So is this walker that's killing these or is it the wall rider? Somewhere I can crawl down there. There's a door here. Locked door. Looks like we're going through the crawl space. Let's put some light on. Hmm. <coughs> what is my objective? Find a way out of the sewers. Have I missed anything on my documents and notes? Nope. I imagine I missed a few of those by this point. <laughs> but I've got enough to understand what's going on. That's the main thing. Righty. Oh, two ways to go. I'm guessing these both lead to the same. Yeah, both lead out the same way. Let's make double sure so I haven't missed anything. Ah, because that one's blocked. So can I jump up here? Yeah. Hi. Bye. <laughs> Go away. So this is where I was just looking before. Oh. Mm, deep water. I'm wasting all my batteries as well. Excellent. So let's climb up these boxes. Up, one, up, two. Ah, oh, and another drop. Thank you, police car, for driving past at that very time. That's a dead guy. There's a way up here. I think I might take that. I don't like water bits in games. It doesn't seem to be anything I'm missing. Oh, it's too dark to take the torch off. Okay. So I pretty much have one way to go. That's good. Let's explore it. Using it. Ah, I have to go back in. Right. I can't go that way, so... I'm going to bump into something soon. I've got... Oh, it was a stalactite. I was going to say stalactite or stalagmite. Stalactite, I think. Tight to go down. <laughs> Lovely big empty room. Some kind of landmark in the middle.
I can hear chains. Oh god. Let's just get through this as quickly as possible without searching. Oh god, I'm running out of batteries though. So that's where I came from. Where do I get the feeling I'm going to find something that says flick all the power switch, all the valves in the room? What's that? Bin bags. Oh, battery. <sighs> it's not going to be a jumping puzzle, is it? Broken ladder. Broken ladder there, so maybe I need to get up to this walkway. He's getting closer. There he is! Hello, friend! Run! Run! Clang, clang, clang! Oh, oh he can't climb. He can't do that, can he? Oh! Ooh. That was good. I got through that quite quickly. Are you okay? Oh. Okay, maybe not. And we'll close that behind us. Hey, so back to the mail ward. What? Go away! This guy's attacking us. He's gone. Okay. So it was that way. Sorry, I'm just going back to see if there's anything else at the end of this corridor. No? Right, so let's proceed. Boo. Let's not disturb him anymore. Let's proceed onwards. Hmm, that's red tint to that water. I don't know if I can actually hear a chain in the background or if it's just my... No? Just my imagination now, I'm listening for chains. And the walker, hmm. What a bugger. Um... Hmm. Something doesn't sound right. There's a staircase there. There's a room here. Ooh. Thought the sewer couldn't smell any worse. Hundreds of bodies crammed into a room. Thousands of flies. Is this the priest's way out? I certainly hope not. I would hope there was a nice way out of this place. Okay, so we're in the mail ward now. Let's get some light in the go. And off again. Okay. 
this appears to be something there. Let's push that. Oh, hello. Less of that, please. Okay. So lots of directions to go. Let's try this door first. Hmm, so a chair and lots of blood. Nice. Um, that goes up, so let's leave that for now. there. Why would I want to move that? Maybe a digital camera. He seems deformed but okay. Let's check up the staircase before I Open the door and let, ever, let whatever beast he's hiding behind it in. Okay, so this looks locked too. I don't think I've seen one of these great metal grate doors that opens as of yet. Okay. It can't be Walker, because if it was a Walker, that thing would be down. You would, regardless of what's in front of it. Three doors. One. Two. Uh, I think I'll probably end up in there at some point. No, not three doors. Two, three ways to go. Two doors and an event. Get the hang of this one, Dave. Pressing the right button. Project Wall Wall Rider Cot Report. Patient status report by Rick Trager. This patient also, unfortunately, didn't make it. I tried my best, but I'm just a doctor, not a miracle worker. And I'm pretty new to this whole doctor thing, so I'm still working out all the kinks. Anywho, somebody's got to cut the f fat from this Project Wall Rider disaster. We've been bleeding money ever since this thing went tits up on the account of that Billy kid but I've managed to slim back personnel by more than eight people, which means short-term savings in salary and long-term savings in pension and healthcare costs. And I've been figuring out a lot about biology. I was on the fence about it before, but now I can say with absolute certainty that a person can't live without his kidneys. You learn something new every day. Okay. Well, of course you can't live without your kidneys. They filter impurities from your system. He doesn't look monstery. Maybe I can get in there and help him. It sounds like there's people behind these nets. These nets. These curtains. Does 
doesn't look like there's anything that way. So let's continue this way. They're coming for me. Close. Safe. No. Let's go this way. Oh my god, I can see them come from me through the windows. <laughs> Well, ladies and gents, after that fun little chase, I think I'm going to call an end of the episode there. So thank you for watching episode 5 of Outlast. Hope you've enjoyed it. And check back to so find episode 6 in due course <laughs> tomorrow. I'll catch you all in a bit. Good night, goodbye, and ciao.